Good afternoon. I'd like to call the Budget Committee meeting to order. I am Jan Burdick, uh, Chairman. We will start with roll call, please. Mrs. Burdick? Here. Mr. Barnes? Present. Mr. Curran? Here. Mr. Fanton? Here. Mr. Rickey? Here. Mr. Rumfelt? Mr. Stockin? Here. And Mr. Harris? Six present, one absent. Thank you. And I will take a motion for approval of the July 17th minutes, please. Fanton? Second. Any corrections or uh, additions? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Carried. And now we will have County Treasurer Terry Ross with the sales tax report. Welcome, Terry. Good afternoon. Um, everyone has the new, newest report in their packet. And um, you'll notice that we're still down about 2.5%. Um, again, that's about the average across the state. Um, but we are, we are still targeted to hit our budget um, estimate. And um, right now we're still a million, a million one over that estimate. So we should be in good shape. Um, right now, you know, we're we're four hundred and fifty thousand dollars short of where we were last year at this time. Um, you do notice the two big adjustments that were in there. Um, trying to figure out what's going on there with the state remittance, um, but it's hard to get information. So do the best I can. Any questions for Terry? Um, Terry distributed a couple information packets from that she got when she went to school, and I really would encourage everyone to uh, look those over and read them. There's some valuable information on what's going to happen down the road with the state, and um, we'll get, we'll probably have a presentation on that at a later meeting, and uh, just to give you an idea of what's going to happen in the future budgets, because I think we need to be not just looking at our current budget. I think we may need to be looking down the road and the consequences of some of these things the state's looking to do. So uh, we'll get, and I yes. think they're good information and I think we'll, is. we'll hear some of the same stuff again at NISAC in September, but it'll be good to be ahead of the game. Yes, Mr. Healy. Thank you. Um, I just point out that the federal government, Department of Labor had to uh, 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 change your uh, uh, job numbers today uh, uh, from uh, first of the year on there are about 880,000 more jobs they've been reporting and they actually had been created so I think the state of the economy is a lot worse than we've been led to think uh, overall and that could count for uh, a lot of the sales tax we know New York has its own challenges but it's, uh, those are the numbers that uh, we've been given by the federal government and obviously they aren't accurate and uh, uh, I, th I don't think their unemployment figures are accurate either but that's my opinion. Any other questions for Terry? Um, Terry, um, I know you're working, you and Chris are working on the 2025 budget. Can you just give us an update of a time frame and the comments about whether everybody wants the big binders or not. Um, it's kind of a lot of money to print all those and I don't know how much everybody really looks at them, so. Yeah, we were talking about a couple changes to the budget presentation when you guys get your um, department head packet. Um, we're looking at September, sometime near the end of September. Um, I know Ashley just um, announced a training for you on the 25th. Um, we were looking at the 26th, but I'm not sure if that's doable or not. We'll go back to the calendar and see if there's something else that might work so that it might fit with your guys' schedules as well. But um, the, the binders that we usually give you for the department head are large. They're well over 500 pages, and um, you know we have to get them all prepared and ready. Um, we have talked about it for many years, just trying to give it to you electronically, but I know a lot of you don't don't really like the electronic version and you'd like a hard copy so if at some point between now and you know the beginning of September or the mid September you can give me an idea if you want a book or if you don't want a book for the department head presentation um, and I'll accommodate you whatever way you want but I think I'll leave it up to you how you want to get those documents so um, you can let me know between now and then okay thanks Terry yep you're welcome right. any other questions for Terry today budget or otherwise Yes, Thanks, Terry. You're welcome. All right, and then uh, we'll go to unfinished business. Um, I failed to mention during the Human Services Committee meeting, 
to remind everyone that after our meetings today, we will be having a tour of the 55 Chamberlain Street property. So I'm not sure if everybody's just driving there themselves. I'm assuming that um, if you need any directions or whatever, just let one of us know and we can we can help you out there. I know that Dr. Anderson and Lindy will be there. Um, so if you have any questions about offices or whatever, they'll be there to answer those questions. Any new business today? Go to the order. And I'll take a motion for adjournment. Rick, you move. Current second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Carried. Thank you all.